uh, supersonic and now you can see the the underside looks like an arrowhead which is uh, has uh, very small wings for such a big vehicle here we are coming around the hack as we call it a, a, a circle to line up <coughs> for uh, the straightaway just prior to landing at uh, Kennedy Space Center that runway didn't look near as big from there by the way <coughs> as it had looked from on the ground These are lights that uh, we use for lineup. Uh, we, we also have automatic guidance on board that helps us. But, <clears throat> of course, uh, we were manually flying the machine from about nine-tenths uh, Mach number on down. Yeah, Vance won't say so, but as you see on a second, two red and two white lights means you're right on the glide path. But he did a super job of uh, bringing the airplane in and landing it. It was... Uh, two red and two white. I think it was a real uh, thrill for all of us. Uh, we really enjoyed being able to come into the Cape. On the left, you see another light used for reference. Here are the gears coming down. Hoot put it down at about 400 feet. <clears throat> On the ground cameras have us coming over the threshold here. A little bit of ground fog, but not, not enough to bother. Streamers coming off the wingtips. We're going to make them red and blue for the next mission. <laughs> <laughs> and the nose coming down and then uh, braking. We, uh, we just did light braking. We used up a large part of the runway, but we didn't really need to. We really enjoyed it on orbit. Uh, I wasn't sure at one point we were going to get uh, Bob and Bruce in from the second EVA because they just wanted to stay out there so that we could come home like this. And the rollout, and uh, after about 30 minutes, uh, we came down the stairs. We weren't in a big hurry because we wanted to get our land legs back. Met uh, Mr. Abbey, the, our, our boss. <clears throat> Walked down the red carpet at the Cape. Then decided, well, let's take a look at the ship, see how it fared. And we decided we'd better get back on the red carpet again. <laughs> <laughs> Well, this, uh, this crew adapted very well to space flight, and uh, I think we adapted uh, very quickly back to Earth again. We enjoyed the flight. <laughs>